Well, as you probably know, the eclipse is just about here. Really no chance of any kind of uh, rain or thunderstorms during the eclipse. No concerns there. The one thing, obviously, everyone wants to know about is sky cover. This is what we think is going to happen as far as sky cover. We'll scroll through slowly in the morning. Eclipse starts between 10 and 11. You can see an area that's mainly thin, high clouds across uh, mainly Sublette County into western portions of Fremont County. This can vary by a few miles. Just keep an eye on the sky there. There might be a few high clouds out there. But all in all, during the totality between 11 and 12 o'clock, Looking pretty good. Most 40% uh, sky cover. A lot of places could end up being completely clear. So looks like we have good news in that effect. However, there's one thing we got to worry about. Smoke on the eclipse. No sun up in the sky. All right, my apologies to uh, David Coverdale and Deep Purple for that terrible parody there. However, we do have a lot of smoke in the area. If you look outside, you can see a lot of the mountains are obscured by the smoke drifting in from the wildfires. Coming from a long ways away, as far away as Oregon, Washington, Idaho, and Montana. And that still could be around in the morning. Now, it's really hard to predict what the visibility will be like. A lot of uh, micro-scale factors may come into play there. So that could be the one factor for this. But all in all, looks like pretty good conditions across much of the area. As far as any weather resources, anywhere along the path of totality, Jackson down to Casper, you want weather.gov slash RAW. Further east, say from uh, about the Douglas area, over toward um, the Nebraska Panhandle, weather.gov slash COYS, CYS, I should say. And also you can see the eclipse page down at the bottom there. And one more thing, we will be live tweeting the eclipse, weather permitting, of course. Follow us along at, at NWS Riverton. Enjoy the eclipse, everybody. Have a good day.